Aloha, and welcome back to Physical Therapy for a Better Life. I'm your host, Christine Linders, physical therapist and board-certified orthopedic clinical specialist. I am excited to introduce you to my friend, Roberta Hobert, who is a wellness advocate and essential oil specialist, and she is going to tell us and explain to us and enlighten us about some of the marvelous benefits of essential oils. Welcome, Roberta. Thank you, Christina. I am so excited to be here. It's a, a, that's the kind of uh, opportunity that us wellness advocates look for daily, a chance yeah. to bring what you know, uh, ancient times have taught us, you know, uh, health through plants. So I'm very pleased to be here. Thank you so much. I'm so and glad. Okay, so essential oils. So I have had this um, knowledge of essential oils and like kind of had my fingers in, but I leave it to you specialists to know all the research of like how to do everything. But I've been using them for a couple of years now, little bits, pieces in here. And I, and I love essential oils. And I know that when we play volleyball together, I got stung by a bee and you gave me like say peppermint or something and it made the sting go away. And I get some serious skin reactions from them. And then we're playing and you were taking something else or smelling something and playing like an Olympian. And, and I just am so fascinated that I, you know, we met the other day and I was like, I want to order this. I have really bad allergies. I want to order this. My friend was having me put lavender on my feet before sleep. And I love natural stuff. And how, how does all this essential oils, these natural plants help to support our bodies or like, how does it work in our system? Enlighten us. Yeah, they, they, it's a very, simple um, answer to that, you know, we're natural, right? So we have the not natural compounds that come in essential oils that interact um, perfectly with our body. So um, let's start like with the beginning. So um, what are the essential oils, right? So they're like compounds extracted from plants. It could be roots, trees, leaves, um, and each compound uh, has its unique characteristic. So uh, there's tiny sacs uh, in, in the plant that protect uh, the plants from viruses, bacteria, you know, seasonal traps. And that's what we extracted from the plants to use to help us in this lifestyle that's what i call you know so um so that that's a little bit of essential oils and um so um why doTERRA is so special because they source where the the plant is where it's the, the plant most thrive like of course we can plant pineapple in uh, i don't know like peru but yeah. the pineapples, they're most happy in Hawaii. <laughs> so when we do this, this kind of things, we change the, the, the chemical profile of the plant. So that's why the terror is so special. They, they came and they want to learn from the most knowledgeable people, which are the, the, uh, the people who work in these farms for centuries. Yeah. And uh, they go to each country where these plants are happy to extract those oils. And uh, there's this thing called CTPG, which is um, um, a guarantee that these oils, they are beyond organic. They don't have heavy metals, pesticides. Uh, and this is done through a third party. doTERRA runs its own um, test, but it's also done by third party. So that's why uh, when you think about, we're like talking about um, wellness industry. This has been growing greatly lately, especially after, you know, this past few years mm -hmm. that what we had to deal with, you know? Yeah. So um, just thinking that you can trust something, you know, cause you see essential oils in every shelf. Yeah, at yep. Walmart, you see at Ross and, and, and then you compare, you know, the price of one and the other. And then you're like, why is Oter 
value is <laughs> yeah. with data, right? I don't say it's expensive because, you know, uh, when you're talking about your health, you want the best mm -hmm. for your health. Yeah. So what happens um, when we, wh what do we do, you know, to extract the, the essential oil? We take out the, the essential oil from the plant and each plant have like, some plants have like, like willow tree, uh, where aspirin was inspired from. Right? Right. Yes, it came from, from, um, from the willow tree. So what they do, they isolate one or two chemical compounds in the plant and they make in a lab a synthetic drug. So all the drugs that we see out there, they are inspired on this chemical compounds that come from plants. Yeah. So why not um, go to plants as our first um, you know, choice first. I, I, I'm not against like, um, you know, synthetic meds, but I think we are uh, used to popping pills, popping pills, popping pills. Oh, a little headache, popping pills. Like you were mentioning about what do I do when I'm like yeah. playing and stuff, you know? And uh, yeah. I, I, I take in peppermint. Peppermint also helped me with my headaches. I used to be a preschool teacher, like for many years, and I loved the kids, the profession and everything, but it, it was very, um, uh, like stimulating, you know, for me, like the, the yeah. sounds and stuff. So I used to have headaches, uh, practically daily and, uh, taking ibuprofen and you don't want the, that toxic load to just sit in your body. So. I, what I started doing, peppermint for headache, just applying mm -hmm. over here, a little bit on your neck. And it's like nature just pulls out the headache from, from you. So you're using this for volleyball too, right? You were using something while we were playing volleyball. What were you using? Peppermint. Um, well, besides a bunch of other oils that I, I carry on my little pouch, eh, you guys? probably see oh my gosh she goes through that pouch all the time uh so peppermint like for 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 me for volleyball if i inhale well that's for that's basically for every anyone if you put a drop of peppermint and you inhale deeply like for 30 seconds uh it's gonna help like open your airway airways oh. and it kind of it's a boost of energy like yeah. even if you don't do coffee but you need that that charge you know that's that's what happens and then internally same thing it kind of acts on your mus muscular system it seems like i'm i'm more ready to to go you know uh it's just that that little especially on, on practices yeah because it's yeah. like go 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 because when we're playing it's a little we play longer but yeah uh, we have little breaks but then practice is like go 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 right so that's why i'm like every time we go to drink water i pop like a little beadlet which is like a, a quarter of a drop inside yeah. that little sack i just put it in my mouth i pop it and then i'm able to stick longer you know with the yeah. intense activity well i could see that and i want i want that for myself you know anything that we can do to help improve or support our system like to allow ourselves to I think function better or or not even better but to function optimally like how about that how about to sleep well to function optimally to think more clearly like to our biggest potential I know so many of us like with the pandemic and everything struggle with stress and sleep disturbances and being more tired like I I say it I hear it all the time I'm tired I feel listless I'm not sure what's going on you know and we kind of were in like a two year of a haze and now we're breaking out into our haze and we want to have this like vitality that i see you have when you're helping yourself with these essential oils it's it's infectious it's a lifestyle right it's a lifestyle that i crave to be back into like post pandemic so to speak like i crave that wellness i crave feeling my my best it doesn't have to be perfect but i want to feel my best i want to optimize my potential you know Mm -hmm, definitely and and it's simple um usually like we like for this 
things that you just share that you want to improve it's, it's it's very very simple you know we can help people with all kinds of things but like sleep lack of sleep affects us tremendously like in all areas right mm -hmm. uh so even when you are like for me if i i'm tired i lay down and i i've been in this lifestyle for four years so i think you know things like the more you stick to it becomes your your body responds better to it you know your your mind kind of changes so i i am tired i sleep like for eight hours nine hours easily however for the uh, quality uh, restorative sleep uh, mm -hmm. i just put like a drop of either lavender I'm gonna stay with the basic oils, but there's yeah. like tons of options that you can use if you um, if you don't like the smell of lavender. You know, there's cedar wood, there's vertiver, there's a bunch of other options for you. So you just inhale, or you can spray in your um, pillow, oh. and your sleep is gonna be more restorative. So I, I do that, engage in this kind of stuff. Uh, and then in the same token, like lavender, like today I was making a, a waffle, I burned my hand and then I put um, a little lavender. There's not a blister or anything. It's just, uh, you know, the pain is gone and there's no blister. So, wow, you know, sleep, uh, skin. Um, it's, there are so many options with the oils. Uh, anxiety too. Lavender is great for for people who are anxious and um, you know, uh, focus. Mm -hmm. Rosemary, lemon. We kind of talked about that you know the other day, and um, even like the lemon for for detox. Oh yeah, I I just put a drop in my first water of the day. You know, before eating anything, just and it's simple. It's like you know, you're traveling, you don't, you're not going to carry a, a lemon in your purse, you know, it's right there. So yeah, um, it, it's amazing, like how um, the endless options and benefits that you can get, you know, just by carrying like, a, um, we call it like a, a mini pharmacy, you know, yeah. so it's like about 10 oils that you just carry with you wherever you go. And you're able to help like, like I did that day, you know, you got stung and Yep. You know, uh, my daughter, we were camping. She got uh, the Portuguese men of war um, all wrapped up in, in her arm. And yeah. then lavender and tea tree. And then oh. the burn is gone. And it, so, yeah, it's just, it's, it's very exciting. You see, <laughs> if you have like a sore throat, uh, yeah. you can apply on your, on this area. Um, there are three ways to use essential oils. Um, so for, first, aromatically, that's what we kind of already talked up, a, a lot about, the limbic system, yeah. the, the seed of emotions, you know. Uh, sometimes you, you smell like a tree, you know, it, it kind of brings you to the past, like to your grandma's house or so yeah. it's, it's very um, responsive, right? Yeah. That uh, aromatically. And then you can do it topically, yeah. just, um, you know, on the skin. Uh, usually we, we put uh, on the, the bottom of the feet because the, the pores in the bottom of the feet, they're very large. So the yeah. absorption is, is good. Uh, mm -hmm. Also um, behind the ear, lymph nodes, um, and wrist or pressure points, you know, even like the inside of your ankle and things like that. So, um, and internally. The, um, some essential oils are not, not, not because of the, the quality or uh, it's just the type of the, the, the tree, they're not okay for consumption, like for yeah. internal use, but, um, and I'm talking doTERRA only, yeah, I yeah. don't know about any other yeah. like that's all that's all i i've known so far it's like doTERRA so yeah. like when you do those kind of things like engage with the the natural remedies and um you know the the topical use and that comes i'm gonna 
tie that to other things too, you know? So 22 seconds um, it takes for the molecules of the essential oils uh, penetrate your body. Oh. Yeah. And then they, they, it goes to your brain. 20 minutes, um, all the molecules, they go to, to every cell in your body. So think, think of them. So we use shampoo, um, soaps, uh, lotion. And so everything is absorbed our, our, from our, our skin and goes into our cells. What is the idea of the movement? Um, bring to your house products that are with less toxicity, toxicity mm -hmm. um, because you don't want to overload your endo endocrine system and, and things like that. So that's the whole idea of the movement. You know, like you, you start thinking about your toothpaste, your yeah. shampoo, your soap, because we interact with these products daily. Right, even like the how you clean your house, the products you use to clean your house. So, like On Guard, for instance, I don't have it here, but it's like the immune, immunity blend. Yeah, and that blend, um, we we sold like so much of it during pandemic. Actually, the <laughs> the company grew like crazy during those times because people had time to learn. Yeah, they, they had the you know, and they need it, right? Who wasn't freaking out about everything that was happening? Yeah. So, uh, but that same product I use to clean my kitchen counter. I put in the water to mop the floor. And there's there are studies. I know you you love the the yeah. support, right? The the scientific support. There are studies that they put Clorox and On Guard in the same surface. On Guard kept the surface away. Uh, from bacteria and, and things like that for longer than Clorox. So isn't that amazing? And you're not like uh, being exposed to all that toxic load, you know? You're blowing my mind with everything you're saying because I almost want to go back. On guard for sure, we have been using that to clean the clinic through the pandemic. And at first I was like, oh my gosh, don't we need to use something uh, heavier, but we have kept this clinic perfectly sanitized during this whole pandemic. And what was the other thing that you said? You were talking about like um, the soaps that we use on our bodies, the things that we clean their houses. This morning I was on a call with someone and they were saying how you need to like um, have people in your life that love you back and put veg eat vegetables that love you back consume foods that love you back. And when you think of it that way, use um, remedies, vitamins, oils, things that love you back. And these things that are supporting our well-being. use cleaners that love you back, right? There's no toxic there. They're not harming you. They're loving you back. And I, when you said that, I just thought of this morning and how it is so true, how we look at things, the lifestyle of essential oils and natural healing is we're using plants that love us back, meaning we're using things that are helping to help our system uh, to be its best. I think that's amazing. Yeah, I heard those couple of things and I was like, oh, can't believe it. Like the light bulbs are going off in my head. Yeah, it, it's, it's very empower, empowering, right? It is. And why, why you don't find this, these essential oils in shelves? It's because we want to give people power to make mm -hmm. choices. We want to build communities mm -hmm. like we yeah. are here. Um, yeah. And, um, you know, it's just like uh, about essential oils, plants, they, they've been around for a very long time. It's, yeah. There's like in the Bible, you, you hear like Jesus was gifted mirror and frankincense, mm -hmm. you know, um, like Cleopatra. Mm -hmm. Cleopatra. Yeah. Help me pronounce that. Yeah. Yeah, so, right, yeah. Yeah. So she she was like one of the most beautiful women in history, and they they found like huge plantations of frankincense, you know, in her her property. That's what that was like her secret for beauty for skin. Well, I mean, there's a lot of uh, and then why we lost that contact, you know? 
yeah, pharmaceutical Why? companies yeah. and and it, it it's it's great it's a great um um to to have other options and stuff but first let's try this that's yeah. that's what i suggest to people when uh the reason why i started with essential oils was because of my daughter like she she was seven years old she had respiratory problems um like Benadryl weekly because she was always congested and uh, she would get sick uh, often. And uh, so she, she had to take three medications like daily. And then to me, I was like, but, uh, it's, it's not improving. Well, what's happening here? How about her little, you know, filtration organ, her liver, her, everything, you know, to deal with that heavy load. And um, started taking on guard, like boosting her immune system, and then applying, having her like smell, um, inhale, breathe, yeah, diffuse in the house, uh, put on her spine and the bottom of her, her feet before and after school. Mm -hmm. And uh, nowadays she hardly gets sick. It's been, you know, um, yes. yeah. So it's like. When you when you use um, high quality essential oils, um, you're you're providing tools to your body to um, to combat like threats, and you're not building resistance. A lot of times, when you you know when you go to a doctor, you have an infection, ear infection. Oh, take this and type out. Oh, you took this the last time, so let's change. Oh yeah, because it builds. Resist it doesn't work as well, you know. Yeah, there's a cool thing about the, the essential oils like, if you look at the cellular level, you know, like how uh, by, uh, the, the outside of the cell is uh, oily, so and then we're talking about essential oil, so it penetrates, it works inside the cell. So that's why when you go to a doctor and they go, um, Oh, it's a virus. Mm -hmm. We cannot do anything. They can just go home and rest. That it's not like that with essential oils because the essential oils they penetrate the 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 cell. They go they inside. The virus <laughs> inside the cell, and then the bacteria usually outside of the cell. Yeah. So um, yeah, but a, a lot of uh, great things about you know having this these things like you don't need. You don't need to be like crazy like I am. You being in my house and they are everywhere. It's amazing. However, however you know, having just a few and starting that, um, building that intimacy with it. Yeah. It's, it's amazing. I just want to tell you, though, that coming into your house, I already was <laughs> eating healthier <laughs> and feeling, <laughs> and feeling, you know, like I talk about self-care and how, you know, we all have our path in life and you go through rough times and you go through good times and you kind of get shifted a little bit from your, your path maybe. And, and so you want to get back on that path. And I remember when I came over the other day, just being surrounded in that lifestyle and, and I've been, cra I'm craving getting back to it. Right. I've been craving getting back to it for years since I started moving around and getting a little more unsettled. And, uh, I already was eating healthier and feeling like, fueling my body better just from being around it. And so I think it's so important for people to hear that there's these things out there for us to, to support ourselves. And like, how could someone get in touch with you or how could they learn more about it? If they wanted to, if they're like me, like, okay, get me started. I want to, like, I bought the thing for my allergies because I take Zyrtec just every day. And, and I, I want to uh, support my body better, like your daughter. And so let my own immune system do it instead of putting a pill that stops the histamine reaction. You know what I mean? So that my nose doesn't get all congested. But how can someone, if they're like, oh my gosh, I have to talk to Hoberta, I wanna, I wanna find out how I can add essential oils in my life. Like maybe they need like allergy something, or maybe they're not sleeping well, and, but they don't like lavender. How can they get in touch with you or find you? Okay. so. Uh either through Instagram. I have a page in Instagram. Okay. Uh, it's mostly in Portuguese, like the posts that I, that I do there, but I'm, I'm yeah. trying to improve that, you know, bring some more um, themes in English. Also, I, ha I do have a website. It's uh, oh. doTERRA slash Roberta Robert. Okay. Uh, so you can go there and it, it kind of, it'll bring you to 
straight to my website. Okay. Uh, or you can give me a call, you know, because uh, what I like to do is uh, to have this conversation, like, how can I help you? What is the, the major things that you want to improve in your life? With the, it's, it's good to, because each person is different, right? Mm -hmm. Like, for you, you, you're like, oh, the multivitamins. I'm like, yeah, that's the number one yeah. thing in the era, you know, because we do follow the pyramid of wellness and you know it's just you it's not all about essential oils essential yeah. oils are a, a vehicle to yeah. the lifestyle because of that response that emotional response it's something like that you feel immediately immediately you know? so, but you know the the supplements the science behind um also like i i the co-impact that that was one of the things that okay. kind of i don't know if we have much time but that kind of touch touch my heart like deeply was that work of going into like de developing countries mostly of the, the the places that we bring our oils are like countries that are not as fortunate as we are and mm -hmm. uh so the terra kind of cut the middleman in between so they work directly with these producers and those communities like building hospitals schools bringing water like drinkable water so that that's the you know where like I'm yeah like, I'm like I I I want to align myself with something greater than you know we can we can reach so much mm -hmm. through the company that um, yeah it's amazing so give me a call or my, uh, send me what? a message message on Instagram what's your phone number eight zero eight three three zero three seven zero seven Okay, and your Instagram was, tell me again. Roberta underscore Robert underscore. Okay, no, that's great. I know we should talk a little bit more um, next time. I think we have like a minute or so left, but maybe just a minute and uh, about the whole bringing it into different countries and different situations. Like I know you mentioned hospitals during the pandemic and high stress areas that they're bringing essential oils and corporations for the workers to kind of keep that sense of calm and well-being while they're working so hard. And I think that is really amazing. I know it's a whole different show and hopefully you'll come back and be with us. <laughs> Definitely. I would love to, to, to share more. That's, that's where my heart is. And uh, I think I found like a, a, a way to, to bring something good to people's life, you know, like yeah. using the, the, the heart of the company and and the products and everything is like just amazing you should come to convention with me one of these days uh, i'll come i'll come fun. next time i would love to i would love to uh, oh yeah. my gosh well we have to wrap it up Roberta. thank you so much for coming on and sharing your wisdom i learned so much more actually listening to you today too and um thanks to think tech hawaii and all the producers and sponsors for allowing us to be here today Life is better when you listen to your physical therapist. Aloha, everyone. Thank you so much for watching Think Tech Hawaii. If you like what we do, please like us and click the subscribe button on YouTube and the follow button on Vimeo. You can also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and LinkedIn, and donate to us at thinktechhawaii.com. Mahalo.